गुड आफ्टरनून स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ पॉपुलर टेक्नोलॉजी कॉल्ड मीन स्टैक मीन स्टैक इज यूज फॉर फास्टर डेवलपमेंट एंड इज कंज्यूम्स लेस मेमोरी एज कंपेयर टू अदर टेक्नोलॉजीज इन दिस द टर्म द मीन स्टैंड फ्रॉम मोंगो डी बी अ नॉन रिलेशनल डाटा बेस देन एक्सप्रेस फॉर नेविगेशन पर्पज एंगुलर वी हैव नॉट डन इन दिस पर्टिकुलर प्रोजेक्ट सो वी विल बी गोइंग टू नॉट जे एस नॉट जे एस इज बेसिकली यूज फॉर क्रिएट getting the client request and getting it processed by the express js and for this what we have going to do is we are going to first of all go to the command prompt after going to the command prompt we can create any directory i have created a directory called this employee nodes under employee nodes i can write down a program using any editor i have done it using this i write node server dot js this is for running it and uh, if i want to create it what i will do is i will write notepad any name followed by js js stands for javascript and there you can see the libraries which i have included express body parsers mongo and so on and I, my application is running on this particular port number Uh, you can run it on any particular port number port number are like channels used in the dish tv and all the other technologies now what you will do is simple task which i did nod after that you go to the browser on the browser you go to your local host column 3000 add employee you can add an employee over here if you try to be smart and just press the submit button it it will not work you will have to enter all the information you have entered the record now you can say read all employees you can see the records which you have entered after you have entered the records if you want to add more records you can do it over here or you can press the back button <coughs> and if you want to see a particular record you can go to this you can see from here what you have entered you have entered current beer 2001 and 100 for example so when you have to read the record single record you read this you enter this you enter this you enter the phone number you press the submit button here is your record you want to enter you can enter over here otherwise back back you want to delete a particular record press the delete button enter the record enter everything press the submit button go to read all you can see you want to read a particular record you press the read button press the submit button here is your record current b 2001 phone is 100 here is it now you can find your record where is the record gone that's it so now after that if you want to delete a particular record 
Now what record will you delete? So what you do, you enter a proper record. Now what do you do? You want to update the record, you enter the phone number of that particular person. <coughs> phone number should not be duplicated, otherwise it will give you the wrong, wrong results. So what you have to do in that case, you go to add employee, enter over here, Enter the password, enter the phone number, mm -hmm. give a numerical value. Now what you will do over here is, if you want to verify whether the record has been entered or not, what record you entered, current B 222949s. Now what you do, you go to update, four nines. Press the submit button, here is your record. You want to update the record? You want to enter the record? You enter the record. You update? Okay, now you see. See. So that's all for this particular project. Thank you very much.